In this video, we will discuss about numeric data in R. In R, all the decimal values are uh, referred to as numeric data type. And uh, this is the default working data type in R. Uh, consider uh, we have a variable x and assign it to some numerical value. For example, x variable is assigned a uh, numerical value of 6.5. And uh, we print x to see what is the output uh, let's run this you will see that the value of x printed is 6.5 which we which we have assigned to x this output never tells us uh, about uh, the numeric data type to check the class or uh, the data type of the object we need to run the class function on x object and you will see that it is telling that uh, the class of object x is numeric which is the default data type of uh, numeric decimal uh, or integer numbers uh, one can also confirm uh, the data type of uh, object x using is dot numeric function for example is dot x you will see that it results in true it means that the uh, data type of object x is numeric if it is false, then it means that the data type of object X is not numeric. Instead of assigning a decimal number, let us assign a whole number to variable X and then check its class. I have assigned a value 5 and uh, we print its value and check, its, uh, and check the class of object X you will see that uh, even though we have assigned a whole number but the class of uh, the object x is numeric it means that the default data type for numbers is numeric in our language uh, one can also create a variable called a numeric variable using a numeric function it will create a vector of zeros for example if uh, i use numeric function and uh, write a uh, and write 5 in the parentheses of the function and uh, assign this and assign the results of this uh, function to z variable and uh, print z and check the class of z you will see that z contains 5 0 and the class of uh, z is numeric and uh, there are also other method as this for the creation of numeric vectors uh, we will discuss them in uh, upcoming uh, videos note that numeric data type is different from integer we will also learn it in upcoming video thank you